Hi guys, so I am back with my update and I'm gonna tell you guys day two was a bust. Um it was going okay, but I was out and about. Um I had a I heard of a job listing and I wanted to go get the job and so I was trying to get my resume updated and do all that and I wasn't thinking about eating and baby it caught up with me. It caught up with me really quick to the point to where you know how you get so hungry. It's like you better feed me something now. I don't care what it is. I don't want no fruits. I don't want no vegetables. Well, I ended up eating fruits and vegetables, but um, I ended up eating. Um, I ended up eating cheese, some mozzarella cheese. Um, I ended up eating a bag of noodles that was at night, and I ended up having salad dressing. I'm not supposed to have any of those, but. Those that was my that was my mess up for day two. That was my best moment. But I'm still doing it. Day three, we're at the beginning, and I am finding. Well, I already knew this, but it's really being it's really becoming apparent that I am an emotional eater. Not so far as oh, if I'm sad, I want to eat, or if I'm happy, I want to eat. But if I can't eat what I want to eat. I get angry and agitated and I'm on edge. That's what I mean by being an emotional eater. It's like I have almost no self-control when it comes to my food. I mean, I do have self-control, but it takes a little while for me to get there. It's like I really have to have that conversation in my head. It's like, come on, Misha. I know you want a burger, but you said that you were going to do this for five days. I know you messed up yesterday. But come on, let's do this. And then the other side of me is like, fuck you. I want some eggs and some bacon. It's turkey bacon. I can eat that. And you can have like some salad on the side. And you don't have to tell them that you cheated. <laughs> that's, those are the, that's the war that goes on in my mind. But like I said, I would never lie to you guys. Um, So like I said, I did mess up yesterday. Today... I am drinking a green smoothie. I'm all frowned up drinking it with some chia seeds <laughs> and I'm drinking my water. And I do find that, you know, when I'm initially hungry and I can't have what I want, I'm a little bit upset. But once it gets in my belly and I'm not hungry anymore, I'm fine. I don't know. But this, this, those are the problems. Those are my issues. That is my journey so far for just these two days <laughs> it's tough it's tough i i guess we live in a world where food is so celebrated and uh, you know we eat for pleasure and training yourself to eat for nutrition and not for pleasure is is hard and so i'm gonna end this video because it's all over the place and i am feeling all kinds of out my mind <laughs> right now. So I'll talk to you guys later.